Hey everyone, this is our jail facade. It's finished, it's awesome. Ugh, we're not finished, not even close. We just started. Well, kinda, we're like a quarter of the way through. Um, and I wanna show you guys. So we didn't have any neighbors around this morning, so we're like, bust out as much as you can before someone comes and talks to us. <laughs> we love our neighbors, but. We can't get anything done when they're around. You guys know how that is. Once you start pulling stuff out, your neighbors are like, what you doing? How you doing? Can my pl kids play on your stuff? So here's the inside. There's a little window and I started painting over the brick. If you guys uh, remember, or if you want to, um, you can check out our 2012 video. This is the brick paneling that went behind our large foam crypt tomb coffin and we made a window and it was a red color here it was that color and now I'm painting it kind of a boring mud color like they would have in the old west no more pretty brick but I'm, I might get a little fancy on there you know me um, and then here we skinned it. I already started painting this side. And here's all of this. We had to shim it up big time <laughs> once we attached. So there's some shims right there and some shims right there. And of course, we're going to put some boards underneath there and then uh, we'll skin it and and mud it and let's see we put some logs up there on the top we were going to bust out the corner and make it look like it was all dilapidated up there but I was like you know what Chris then you have to take the bracing off the top corner and I don't know it just makes me nervous because we actually would like people to go inside and take pictures um, we're gonna put metal bars in both of the windows and this one will be so people can take pictures. And I'll show you that bracing on the top. It's nothing but a, a corner piece, but it sure makes a difference. And let's see, what else can I share with you guys? Um, shoot, that's about it for now. Just flat walls and skinning it, and I'm gonna paint it. Chris is going to put some bars up and then after that, we'll just mud it. And you know, pretty soon we'll have another facade done. Good morning, everybody. Here is uh, the update on the jail. We, uh, we just got flying on it yesterday and uh, stayed up real late last night painting on it. Um, it's much like the one we did before. You'll notice that up above, the, some of the logs are missing. We're gonna cut out big chunks of uh of wood and then fill it in with foam to kind of give it like a brick and a rock look and we may bust a a piece like a hole all the way through over on this side so let's go take a look at this thing we're gonna probably paint jail up there maybe um these bars are metal uh i made it exactly the same way as i did the other so if you're interested on that you can check out that uh, the other jail video um, but when we come in here this is going to be basically made for people to walk into and on this side is going to be a totally enclosed cell with uh, bars and we'll probably put like a little cot with a guy laying down there sleeping and we'll have some like snoring sounds and uh, little fart sounds or something because maybe he ate too many beans or something who knows <laughs> but uh, I was gonna set him up to uh, uh, move with uh, it'll be all pneumatic on this side people can just basically enter through here and then they'll just uh, they can get their picture taken from outside in there or they can take pictures of the scene and stuff we gotta age uh, all this stuff and and uh, make it look good but um yeah that is uh, that's how far we got. Basically, um, this 
all these flats it's a lot of flat building a lot of wall panels this center one right here you can see it's kind of loose it's a fake panel and what I did is I just uh, added some wood to this one and this one so that this can be a removable panel so I still have access behind the undertaker to add like lights and all that jazz so that's it we just gotta cut some wood uh, add some foam and make some jail bars and then start slapping some mud on this thing and some paint and then we're done we can move on to the next thing